I've had insomnia about this weekend for so long. I can't even believe that my bachelorette party is in two weekends. One weekend actually because this weekend's basically over today is Sunday and then next weekend is my birthday's on Friday And then I have that weekend and then the following weekend all my girls are coming to town and we're going to Palm Springs I'm so excited like truly cannot believe That my girlfriends all are gonna make the effort to come out here Not all of them are able to come but like a huge chunk of them are able to come and go down to Palm Springs It's always been my dream to have like a Palm Springs retro themed weekend and my themes are different so I have three themes overall it's called Kaylee's flock and it's like flamingo palm trees and desert themed but then so the first night is gonna be a pajama night and it's gonna be low-key we're gonna order some pizza do some fun girly things um, you know masks all that jazz so then on Friday we have fiesta night so Kaylee's last fiesta and we're gonna have uh, tacos and go out tacos and tequila and then on Saturday night we're gonna have like a retro themed night I still don't know like what I'm gonna wear for that but I just feel like we're in Palm Springs we should dress up sort of retro and I'm gonna become a housewife technically not technically but you know um, I'm gonna be a wife that maintains a house so I thought it would be fun like if we all thought of our own the Real Housewife taglines because I love that show and just you know do something fun so yes those are the three nights and then on Sunday we clean up we pack up and then we jet back to LA so that people can catch their flights so it's gonna be from Thursday to Sunday and I can't wait I think I'm gonna wear this outfit for one of the nights or days there because I feel like this is kind of retro y it's pretty cute what are you, t you do you agree? <laughs> no, but you should think I should wear this. Mm -hmm. Thanks. So me and my friends throughout the months leading up to this have been collecting decor and some fun things for us to have during the bachelorette weekend and I wanted to share with you guys what we have compiled so far. Some of them are surprises to them because I bought them and I'm gonna create like a little gift bag for them to get before they go down. I wish I could have worn this shirt because it is so cute. My best friend Brandy, she made everybody t-shirts and they're so adorable. I will put them right here because I don't have them right now. And I also don't want her to see these things before. So she comes early and I wasn't gonna film while she was here. So I'm just gonna film this now without the shirt on, but mine says Princess Bride, and then on the back of mine, it has everything that's on the front of theirs. And they are so stinking cute. I love them, thank you so much for making them. So yes, like I said, I'm making them little gift bags to get before they go down to Palm Springs, and then we'll put up the decorations when we get there. So I also looked around my house to see things that I could repurpose, and I do have a letter board, so I made this Kaylee's Bachelorette Party little sign. And then I'm also going to repurpose that confetti I talked about in my vlog where they were in my 25th birthday balloons and I'm gonna put them on here and we're gonna put some like cute little things like little snacks and stuff on this tray that I already had I also printed out these cute little cards to put in their bags this is just the map of Palm Springs that they can keep and just look around at and I just thought it was cute cute little thing just to throw into the bag because they're at Palm Springs and then this one is our itinerary so I did switch the days fiesta day is going to be on or fiesta night is going to be on Friday night because two of my friends have to leave and I think fiesta night will be more fun than the retro glam night so this is also what I'm going to slip into their little gift bag as well just so they, they have the map of Palm Springs and then our little itinerary but I'm not going to stick to the itinerary like if things you know happen to not work out we'll just make a plan B and do something else fun but just to have you know a guideline of what we're gonna do I'm definitely gonna be vlogging so by the time you see this we'll probably have already been on the bachelorette weekend um, and I will definitely post a vlog after I post this then I'm bringing these fun sunglasses because why not I already had these pineapple sunglasses that I was actually gonna throw out because I was thinking when am I ever gonna wear these well this is why you keep things because you never know and then I got these retro heart sunglasses which I also got for everybody. They look a little different though. I will show you those in a second. And then I got 
these flamingo sunglasses my mom gifted me a long time ago and it was perfect so bringing these so like I said I got the girls heart sunglasses because they're super cheap and really cute looking uh, they're not as retro as the ones that I have but they're pretty adorable pretty cute love is in the eyeballs so I'm putting them in there also, I will make sure to link everything down below that I can. Some things I know the links of and some things I just don't. Uh, so I will make sure to try to put everything that I can find down below or something similar that, you know, I have. Make sure to check the description box because if you love some of these items, I will put them down there. I don't know the link of this one, but I'll share this. This is also in what I got for Christmas because my friend gifted this for me for this specific purpose. And these are the Flamingo Lights with little, like, Polaroid clips, which I am bringing two Polaroids. I'm gonna ask my friend, my friend, and I'm gonna ask my friend to bring a third because we love Polaroids. Polaroids are just automatic filters and everyone looks beautiful in them. Okay, so I was on Etsy. God, I love Etsy. There's just so many great things on there, so many creative people. I just love it. So I saw these little tattoos from Love and Lion and they sent me this in the mail. They're so easy to work with. They have so many different kinds of tattoos, temporary tattoos of course, and I love this one design. I wanted to swap out one of the little symbols in there because I just thought it would look more like my bachelorette themed and it was this little martini glass. They had, I think it was like a a glass of beer or something and I thought the retro looking martini glass was just perfect for Palm Springs look at how cute they turned out this one is mine of course because it says it's my bachelorette bash if I'm lost buy me a drink and then this one says I'm with Kaylee's bachelorette bash and I just thought they were so adorable and they're pretty reasonably priced and if you're lost don't worry hopefully no one will be getting lost um, that's not the goal here but just in case People will know what to do. Speaking of Etsy, I got this adorable bathing suit from Etsy. Look how cute. It is rose gold themed and it's super sparkly. It's kind of hard to see because of the glare, but let me, there we go. Look how cute. Getting married. And I got this off of an Etsy store called The Cadence. And actually, funny story, um, me and this girl, Tiff, she and I just became friends on Instagram, just randomly. And we've been following each other for a while. I absolutely love her. Her and her fiance, who are also high school sweethearts like Ryan and I, have a YouTube channel. So you should definitely go check theirs out. It's called Tiff and Scott. And they're adorable. And they talk about real life things. And you know, they're a fun couple. So you should definitely go check out her Etsy store and her YouTube channel. And it just happened to be that I've been looking at this for a really, really long time and I looked up the hashtag on Instagram and I saw her in a picture. So I wrote her and cause I read that it said that it was her company and I'm like, wait, what? That's her company? Uh, so yes, go support her. I love supporting local businesses and I love supporting women who I know are just really good people. So support. So I love the little banners that are like stringy banners that go across things. So I don't, I don't know. This one was not put together clearly because they sent these individually, but these will like bunch up into individual tassels and then it'll be like a tassel garland to go across whatever we decide to put it across. And then I also got this rose gold long banner that will go down and we can use that as almost a photo booth kind of looking like thing so yeah rose gold is the theme because that's my ring then I also got you can't really see what it is because it's in the packaging but the packaging comes with this tape and then it comes with a little plastic straw that you put into the different bubble letters and then you blow them up so you don't have to have a certain machine to blow it up and this one is the F final fiesta garland banner and we'll have that for a Friday night and then the other little fun banner I got here was Talk About Love because, like I said, yes tonight, we're having tacos. Talk About Love because that's what we're here for, love and talk. So if you know me, you know that I just feel like I was born in the wrong time period. I love things that are retro themed, real retro, retro, I guess people don't like that word, 
people say vintage but I think retro when I think of the 1940s 1950s I just love that time period and I love old cars absolutely love them so when I walked into world market and I love gummies too so here let me just break this down for you retro things gummies and old-fashioned cars I found in world market all three of my favorite things in one packaging and I was like this is the perfect candy ever to be putting in these gift bags look at them pink Cadillacs aren't they just the cutest thing ever they're strawberry flavored cherry flavored and black Current flavor, as well as the Sour Patch watermelons because these are very bachelorette themed. These are cute little fruits, and I'm gonna get the mango gummies from Trader Joe's, but I have not picked those up yet. I love Vital Proteins, so I thought it would be fun to put something beauty related into the girls' bags. And who doesn't need some beauty collagen in their life? It's strawberry lemon themed, so it'll be very refreshing to throw into your water, and you'll get some great hyaluronic acid and protein into your water. So those are gonna go into the girls' bags as well. So the gift bags that I am talking about are these cute little gift bags that I bought. They're 15 pack of rose gold gift bags. I wouldn't say they're rose gold. I just say they're like pink and they have these cute little straw handles. And then I used my Cricut and I wrote all the girls' names on them. I think they turned out really cute. I just think it's really nice when you put girls' names on things and it makes it special. So these are the bags that the girls are going to get. And then I also got some tissue paper to go on top. I got a bunch of these little flamingo drink cup floaties and I don't know, maybe I'll put them in the bag or I'll just surprise them and just put them out. They were very cheap and they're part of the theme. So this is one flamingo themed thing that I absolutely love. And then we got a huge flamingo floaty because we gotta get those cute kicks on the floaty, you know? You'll just have to watch the vlog to see what this looks like blown up. So I'm also not quite sure if I'm gonna put these in the girls' bags, but I got everybody because it is flamingo themed little boas. Remember back in the day when you were a little girl and you just loved to put on a feather boa? Well, I'm bringing it back and I got all the girls these light pink feather boas and then because I'm the bride, I got one that looks a little different and I got a hot pink one for me. I'm also gonna bring this 90s Uno just in case. Just in case we're sitting by the pool, we all wanna play some 90s Unos. These are adorable and I also got these gifted to me. Clueless girls right here. You got Dawson's Creek. You got Tommy Boy. Just all these different 90s themed movies on these cards. So I thought that would be fun to bring because as you guys know or you don't know, I love the 90s. So for Fiesta Night, because you have to have a pinata for Fiesta Night, I got an engagement ring pinata. Say that 10 times. Pinata, pinata, pinata. That was really cute. I don't think I'm going to stuff it or anything, but I think I'm just going to set it out during Fiesta Night. I got these cactus garland to go across some kind of table, some kind of wall, something. I forget who found these, but these are little cactus shot glasses. So cute! I'm not much of a drinker, but look how adorable these are. I mean, I see why drinking becomes appealing because they have very cute things to entice you to want to get wasted. I also got the these napkins. Sip Sip Olay is what they say on them and they have cactuses all over them and I thought they were super cute. I love it. We're going to be in the desert so we got to have lots of cactus decor. Also I got these napkins just to have out it says last fling before the rain which is a very common saying for brides and i think they're so cute and if i don't use these for my bachelorette party i can definitely reuse them for my bridal shower which is coming up next month i got these really cute pineapple mug water cup things who's gonna put water in it probably none of my friends you know what i'm saying but <laughs> um, I got these cute little pineapple mugs that I may put into their bags as well or I just might put out on the tables for them. But they came with these really cute straws. They were like little Hawaiian flowers on top of them. And I thought those would be fun to have around to stay hydrated. I'll be putting water in them, but 
yeah. Okay, so I only have a few more items left, and I got these large palm leaves because I thought those would look really cute to lay across a table or to put up against a wall. I don't know what we're gonna do with these, but they're made in China, so there you go. I don't know what else to say about them. I'm not going to say that. Say, if I don't use them, I can wipe my with them. Oh, okay. Ryan said that... <laughs> <laughs> Ryan said that um, if I don't use them, I can wipe my butt with them. So, you know. <laughs> don't check on your water. <coughs> You'll be using these for your, for your toilet paper as well. The last couple of things that I want to share with you are these absolutely adorable plates. The Airbnb that we are renting, they have plates, they have cups, they have all that. But I just thought, sometimes you don't want to have to wash all that stuff. So I got a few of these plates. Uh, my, my friend Emily actually ordered these, I think. And they're so cute. This one is flamingo themed because, like I said, that is the theme here. And then the other ones are palm leaves. And these are like little more snack plates. These are kind of like snack plates. And then these are larger plates that we could use for breakfast or anything that we're doing. But... Really, I think we're gonna eat out a good amount. Um, we're gonna have breakfast mostly at the house because my friend Rachel makes a great breakfast. I don't know if I let her know yet that um, I have signed her up to do that, but she makes a really good breakfast. And that is about it for all of the things that I got specifically for the bachelorette weekend. And then I still have to pack stuff for my outfits and such. Maybe I will do a little like video of me prepping for that week you know like a weekly vlog or something but i think i'm going to definitely do a vlog that is solely dedicated for my best right weekend so i can look back on it years from now and remember the amazing time that i had with my girlfriends all right that is it thank you guys for watching this video if you want to see more content like this please let me know and be sure to subscribe because i have a lot of wedding related things coming up if you're not into wedding related things don't you worry i got a lot of other things so you can keep up with me on beauty on lifestyle on trader joe's foods or on costco foods or on any food really because i talk a lot about it in my favorites so make sure you click that subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video thanks for keeping up see you later